it's an absolute pleasure to be here in the third tram of our series of 50 new trams on our system across metropolitan Melbourne. But what we're about announcing today is a $108 million investment associated with the construction of East West Link to improve public transport. And these changes to public transport, these significant improvements in public transport, can only be delivered through the building of the East West Link Stage 1. And what these involve is three important components. Firstly, a massive improvement in the punctuality and reliability and upgrading of the north-south tram routes that cross Alexandra Parade. There's 60 million passengers per year use the north-south tram routes. They are constantly being held up by traffic congestion on Alexandra Parade. With the construction of the East Westland Tunnel, there will be a 30% reduction in traffic on Alexandra Parade. And this provides us with a unique opportunity to work with PTV and Yarra Trams to upgrade those north-south tram routes so we can get a massive improvement in punctuality and reliability, a massive improvement in services, and with the new trams, the people will receive an enormous benefit in public transport through that process. Secondly, Alexandra Parade itself. It is one of the busiest vehicle routes in Melbourne and Victoria. But with the construction of East West Link Stage 1 Tunnel, that traffic will go underground, freeing that great road with traffic. So 30% at least reduction in traffic. And what we've got in place is plans to revolutionise Alexandra Parade and turn it into one of the great boulevards of Melbourne and Victoria. And at the same time, we'll be uh, investing significantly in improved bicycle and pedestrian uh, routes along uh, Alexandra Parade. Thirdly, the Doncaster bus is already used by nearly four million people a year. And the Doncaster rapid transfer bus, the DART bus, will be enhanced uh, through the East West Link process in terms of improved reliability, improved efficiency and improved frequency of services. So there'll be uh, assistance in terms of lanes, in terms of access uh, through Hoddle Street. So again, public transport will be the huge winner through the investment in East West Link. As much as the East West Link is about roads, it's also about public transport and it's also about pedestrians, it's also about cyclists. Uh, one of the great uh, additions to this particular project, of course, is a dedicated cycling path right along Alexander Parade. But across the board, it just goes to demonstrate that this East West Link project is also significantly about improving public transport and improving cycling amenity as well. Music